Hello and welcome to another QT Office video tutorial. Today we are looking at email marketing drip campaigns. So to get started we click on marketing in the main menu. Now if you do not have email marketing as part of your package you'll have a page here telling you how you can add that. Uh, but since we already have it in this account we see our options over here. So we're going to click add edit drip campaigns. And these are some of the existing campaigns, but we're going to create a new drip campaign by clicking the create new drip campaign button. Start by giving our campaign a name. So in this example, I'm going to say that this is for new unit members. And then we can give it a description. to help us remember what it's about and click save. Now we see it here. Uh, we can go back and edit the name but what we need to do first is add and edit emails. We click add new email to add our first and then we can choose from our templates either the QT office templates that are provided or if you've created any custom templates they'll show up at the bottom. Today I'm just going to use a blank template. So we'll start by entering a subject. Welcome to the unit. Uh, we're not saving this as a template so I don't need a name. Next we enter the day we want this email to go out. So if we wanted this email to go out the same day that we assign someone to the campaign we would enter zero if we wanted to go out the next day it would be one the day after that would be two and so forth so this is our first email so I'm going to use zero then we can uh, add a background image if we like we can attach files to this email I'm going to go ahead and just start creating the email and you can click here and you'll get a pop-up explaining how to use the name codes but basically you just put in double bracket first name double closing bracket and when you send this email it will fill in the first name of the recipient so we'll just type out our email and this one is meant to just be a, a welcome and we may provide some information maybe a, a link to our website helpful information to, for them to get started uh, not too much this is just our first kind of introduction email but we put in whatever we want and click save so now we have our first email that goes out on day zero we can edit that email or we can add a new one so let's go ahead and add one more and again, we go through the same process. We would choose a template, give it a subject. This time we're gonna talk a little more about getting started with your new Mary Kay business. And this one, we're, at, we're gonna skip a day. So this will go out on day two. And we can still personalize it with the first name. and then just type our message. Put in anything we like. We can we have the toolbar to to edit things, add links, insert images and so forth. So we'll save this email. You can see we have our two emails and we can continue adding them. Uh, but uh, two is good for now for this example so we can move on to edit assigned to and this is where we actually assign a person to this campaign so that they will start receiving those emails normally um, for something like this for the new consultant um, we're not going to add a group uh, although we can we're probably going to be adding uh, people one at a time so once that person has been added to my team in QT Office, we can come down here and search for them. 
And I believe I have someone called Meg. There we go. So if Meg was a new team member, then I had to simply assign her to this and click save. And now I can see the details. I can see my list of emails. I can see who it's assigned to. The date she was added and she'll get her first email will go out right away. And then the next one will be the day two email. I can delete this person and eventually this list will get a lot longer and most of the people will have already completed this campaign. So if I need to see them, I just click show completed and I can see everybody that's been added to this campaign. But this is a brand new one, so I only have one person. So that's how you create a drip campaign. You can use drip campaigns any way you like. It simply automates a lot of things for you to send out a series of emails on a schedule that you create so that all you have to do in the future is assign that person to the campaign and everything else will be handled for you. If you have any questions about this, feel free to contact us by clicking the help button at the top of your screen.